Hi everybody, I'm Patrick Novotny, this is my YouTube channel, and I'm doing how-to videos on every single necktie knot known to man, and I'm bringing them to you. So if that's the kind of thing you're looking for, then please subscribe. Alright, this time I'm going to bring you an invention called the Frinfrock Knot, done by Mr. David Frinfrock himself. Uh, I want to show you how to do this very cool knot, so let's get started. Okay, so the first step is you're going to drape it over your neck. We're going to be tying it with the little end. So I've got the big end. I want it to be adjusted to about where my belly button is so we can finish out my belt line. All right, let's have a closer look. Okay, so we're going to take the big end. We're going to give it our pinch, bring it to the middle, take the little end. We're going to cross over the top and bring it around the back like so. And now we're going to feed it up through the front, down through the necktie knot. And then we we'll cross over the back so it comes out on the opposite side to where you started. And now here's where the frinfrock knot gets really interesting. So we're going to fold our little end so the seam side is facing that way, which is going to end up facing up as we cross over the front. So taking where we just folded with a little twist, bring it across the front. Like so. And then from here, keeping the fold as we tie this knot, I want to keep this loose because we're going to be intertwining these a little bit. So taking this end, we're going to feed it up through the top of our knock, necktie knot through the back. And then I want to feed it down this uh, front pass we just finished. So there we go. I lost, I lost my fold, so this is what I'm going to do to bring it back. I'm going to fold the bottom and then fold the top with my other hand. Now I can get keep my fold happening here. So this time, my fold is facing this way. So now that I've brought it down, I can cross it over the top. And what I want to do here, or what you guys want to do, is I want to I want to be able to push my uh, material in behind the knot this way. So this appears to be on this side. So it doesn't look like it's crossing over the knot. I want it to be coming from, from that side of the knot and then straight down. All right, and then from here, we'll take the little end. We're gonna wrap it around the back to the opposite side. And now we're gonna feed it up through the top and straight back down, like so. So everything here, I'm keeping nice and loose at the, this point. And from here, now every one of these folds is going to be uh, facing in and the, the open side of our folded little end is always going to be facing out. Now taking the last part of the little guy here, we're going to feed it down through here or feed it under this loop here. And from here this is where all the adjusting comes in if you want to tighten this. If you want it to be a loose uh, knot showing the middle, then you need to stick your fingers in here. And then this is where I would be pinching the inside knot to make it smaller. So taking this little end, depend, depending on how much you have left, if you only have a little bit left, you're going to tuck it in through the top uh, behind your collar. If you have a lot of material left, I like end up doing it from underneath. It just seems to keep this knot more square when it's finished. But what I would recommend at the beginning is tying this knot tight. Just until you learn how to do it well. So now I'm tightening it. And it gets a, a more tighter pattern for you. And it's easier to finish. Instead of just adjusting endlessly to get exactly the way you want. As you can see me adjusting it. All right, so holding on to the, you can pinch the middle of the knot and then uh, pull on the big end to cinch it up. So with some more adjusting, this will look perfect.
So that's how you do the Frinfrock knot. Thank you so much, David Frinfrock, for sending that to me so I can share that with everyone else. So my name is Patrick Novotny. I hope you really enjoy the Frinfrock knot. Uh, this is my YouTube channel, and I'm doing how-to videos on every single necktie knot known to man, and I'm bringing them to you. So if that's the kind of thing you're looking for, then please subscribe, and thank you so much for watching, liking, subscribing, commenting, and of course, sending me your inventions of your necktie knots so I can make videos for you guys. Thank you so much. Oh, my God.